31 year old man and a 30 year old woman have been charged with the murder of their two year old daughter today. The toddler was allegedly killed in a rental flat in Chinsui Road over five years ago, but her remains were found only last Tuesday. Lily Ying with more. Police made a grisly find at this block of flats last week. TNA understands that it was the burnt remains of the toddler in one of the units. The biological parents of the child appeared in court on Tuesday to face their charges. If convicted, they face the death penalty. None of them can be named due to a gag order. Police said the couple has been in remand since the middle of last year for unrelated offences. According to court documents, the woman was sentenced this month to over five years jail for drug-related offences. The man has pending drug-related and rioting charges. Checks show that the couple has been married since 2012 and that this is the woman's second marriage. CNA also understands that the couple has seven children and the dead toddler is the youngest. It's not known if all the children are from the current marriage. In response to CNA's queries, the Social and Family Development Ministry said the couple has other children and that they are under stable alternative care arrangements. It will continue to provide the necessary support to ensure their safety and welfare. Neighbours living on the same floor where the alleged murder occurred told us that the neighbours don't really interact with one another. Those who have interviewed said that they've never seen the couple or the child and neither have they heard or smelled anything unusual. In fact, one of them told us that the first inkling that something was amiss was when police came knocking on doors a week ago. A Buddhist monk who heard about the incident paid his respects on Tuesday morning. He said he doesn't know the family personally. What the thing is a hanpong. For now, there are more questions than answers, such as what really happened and why it took so long for the remains to be found.